up, guys? How we doing? Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to another episode of Rugby Player Reacts to the NFL's Top 100 Players of 2021. It's series number four, episode number 21. We're focusing on Adam Thielen. He's number 80 on the list. He's been voted to that number by his fellow players. And that's what makes this list, I mean, that's what makes this list exciting, interactive, and one I'll always enjoy. So today's video, like I said, we're focusing on Adam Thielen, wide receiver for the Vikings. But before we do, a quick word from our exclusive video sponsor, Redcon One. What's going on, guys? It's me again. First and foremost, thank you for clicking on this video. Secondly, this video is proudly brought to you by Redcon One. Now, for anyone who's been around this YouTube channel for any length of time, you may know, or you may not, that the reason I begun this channel was to do with bodybuilding and fitness. In fact, I've always had a passion for bodybuilding and fitness, and I still do. So it made sense to finally connect with a worldwide trusted supplement brand. And the one that I've chosen for this YouTube channel is Redcon One. Now, personally, I've been using Redcon One products for a good five years. The first product I ever used was Total War. It's a pre-workout. I don't use pre-workouts all the time, but if I do, you can bet your bottom dollar I'm going straight for that Total War. You know, Redcon One as a brand is going from strength to strength. Head over to their website and check out their entire range of products. It's not just Total War, and it's certainly not just supplements. They've got everything. So, whether you are from the United States, whether you're from Canada, or whether you're from the UK and Europe, you have an opportunity to head down into the description box below, check out the website link for whichever of the three regions you're in, use code T20JMC. So that's T20JMC, for 20% off your order. And look, whether it's a t-shirt, a snapback, or a tub of Total War, I can guarantee you're gonna be happy. Once again, this video is brought to you exclusively by Redcon One. Myself and my YouTube channel are proud to be partnered with Redcon One. Head down into the description box below, check out all of the information, and uh, well, happy lifting, guys. And peace out. And would you believe it? It's none other than DK Metcalf. What's he got to say? about his fellow wide receiver, Adam Thielen. Let's have a look. He scores a touchdown, just seeing him gritty. He got the old the gritty dance going on. This is probably the funniest thing I've seen all year. Adam improved, man. From game one to now, he did a great thing for the game. <laughs> you mean, so, so his general play didn't improve, but his gritty did. Uh, what's a gritty? Well, as far as I'm concerned, Gritty is an American power retailer that formerly sold energy to people in the state of Texas. But as far as Adam Thielen's Gritty, uh, okay, here we go. <laughs> he must have he must have pulled it out in a game, and then next minute he's on the Pat McAfee show uh, discussing it. And uh, apparently his effort on the field wasn't that good, but in practice. He's unbelievable. Um, the Gritty is a dance move that Jefferson helped make popular while attending LSU and winning a national championship in 2019. So he's taken it from his teammate, rookie, wide receiver, Justin Jefferson. What is the Gritty? <laughs> well, I've seen... <laughs> I've seen that. <laughs> I actually quite like that. That as a... <laughs> that as a touchdown celebration. No taunting involved. Make of it what you will, but it's funny. What does the gritty dance mean? To get gritty, okay, it's a Fortnite, it's a Fortnite move. The get gritty Fortnite act out is a crossing act out, which means players will actually want to move very much like Justin Jefferson when he's cruising into the end zone. While Jefferson doesn't, while Jefferson didn't concoct the dance, he subsequently made it as famous as he did his own during LSU's title season in 2019. Gritty dance Fortnite. Okay, you can, <laughs> you can get the gritty dance on Fortnite. Uh, belongs to Chapter 2, Season 6. No idea what that means. The gesture can be purchased in the Fortnite item shop for 500 V-Bucks. Is that a good deal? I'm not sure. Thielen seems to think so. Nick Minnett. He's very crafty of a receiver. And honestly, he stressed me out. You know, everybody can do that. Having a good release, having a good stem, having good body movement and body control, oh, and being able to catch yeah. the ball too. But he's able to do all at once. And that makes a great wide receiver, right? Release, speed, agility, great body control, and the ability to go out and catch it. Hey, play fast. That's all that matters. Have fun doing it. You would it, you be nervous. I mean? We've been doing this since we were kids. 
In 2020, Adam Thielen caught 14 touchdowns. Only Devontae Adams and Tyree Kill caught more. It's another touchdown for Adam Thielen. Now, Adam Thielen is always going to be a wide receiver that I remember due to the fact he didn't have the easiest path to the NFL, did he? He went undrafted. He went to Minnesota State Mankato University. His receiving yards went from 225 in his first year to 1,176 in his final year. He played four seasons of college football, 46 games, 2,802 receiving yards. 20 receiving touchdowns. 449 for the 40 yard dash, a three cone drill of 677, which is ridiculously fast. 36 inches on the vertical, 10 foot in the broad jump. And he went undrafted. Did not receive an invitation to perform at the 2013 combine, but he did attend a regional combine in Chicago where he performed well enough to warrant an invitation to the Super Regional Combine held in Dallas. There, he showcased his athletic ability, completing the 40-yard dash in 4.45 seconds and impressing in the three-cone drill with a time of 6.77, a mark that would have placed him in the top 20 at the NFL Combine. He went undrafted, attended a rookie tryout and evaluation session with the Minnesota Vikings. On May 6, 2013, they signed him to a three-year $1.48 million contract. Four months later, they waived him as part of their final roster cuts, but was signed to the practice squad the next day. He saw some preseason action as a wide receiver and on special teams. Next year, in the preseason opener, he had one catch for 15 yards and three punt returns, including one 26-yard return. After a strong preseason performance in both offense and special teams, he earned a spot on the 53-man roster to start the 2014 campaign. Made his NFL debut in the season opener in a road game against the Rams on September 9. In week 5, he caught his first NFL pass, finishing the game with four receptions for 57 yards. That led the team in receiving. He was named NFC Special Teams Player of the Week in week 13 and scored his first NFL touchdown on a special teams play in which he blocked Carolina Panthers <laughs> in which he blocked Carolina Panthers punter Brad Nortman's kick and returned the ball 30 yards to the end zone. Okay, Carolina Panthers and that was all in his first two seasons. He's come into his own. His first Pro Bowl appearance was in 2017. He did it again in 2018, but hasn't made it since. Look, he is a definite top 100 player. He's one of my favorite wide receivers to watch, and uh, let's continue. The red zone was Thielen's playground. All but one of his 14 touchdowns came in the red mm, zone. Look at that. Red Runs zone, backwards the red zone, into the, the end zone. zone. Man, that's where he makes his impact. Okay. I reckon I've seen that before. Red zone, the red I reckon I've seen this exact move. It's in sync. Look, guys, we've had the pleasure of watching the 2020 Tokyo Olympics recently, and there's one sport that this very move reminded me of, and that's synchronized diving. Red zone, the red Bang! Zone, man. That's where he makes his impact. So they move him around a lot. They really know how to use him and get him the ball. <laughs> so I don't know. Time to work, baby. Time to work. I think what really makes him great is the catches that he makes when someone is on him. Feel it, one arm! That's that right there. Catch. It's about as good as it gets. I can just remember. We saw Marquise Godwin do that. Remember watching Adam Thielen, it seems almost like every other week, you know, someone's tight coverage on him and he's still able to make like a ridiculous catch. Wow, oh, another one handed catch, Kenny. That was a great catch. Uh, with with contact and and difficulty, difficulty level is definitely a, a nine out of ten. That was only a nine out of ten on the difficulty. Nine out of ten. Nine out of ten. I, I seen some diff difficult ones. That I'll give it a nine. You gonna tell him that? <laughs> I'll tell him that right now when I go in there. <laughs> Adam Thing Lincoln Ball. I'm gonna tell you that now. <laughs> Don't you love it? I certainly do. Um, Look, they teased us with that video. The first guy we saw was DK Metcalf. We had to wait a whole two and a half minutes to see him again. What number will he be on the list? Only time will tell. Will he be in the top 20? I wouldn't be surprised. I would not be surprised. But if you were to think of him as a star wide receiver for the Seahawks, and you think there's got to be at least one star wide receiver on each and every team, that's 32 players. 
So it ain't easy. Doesn't matter what position you are, doesn't matter what team you play for, it ain't easy to squeeze on this list. And I tell you what, these these top 100 guys should be very, very proud, if nothing else. Anyways, that's enough of that. Another video complete. Uh, here we are, a fifth through the list. We're at number 79. Number 79, Terran Armstead. Left tackle for the Saints. Thanks, guys. It's been a pleasure, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.